What's going on, y'all? <laughs> um, just want to take it in, take it in. This is very special. Okay. Thank you, Sarah K. Ellis and Glad for this moment. I'm so very moved and humbled by this acknowledgement. Thank you, Gab, Gabrielle Union, for reminding us time and time again that you are, in fact, 10 toes down and about that life. <laughs> A life of abundance. What you? <laughs> no, but yeah, a life. A li We got our shoulders out. We don't know how to act. <laughs> no, but she's about that life, a life of abundance where everyone is seen, heard, and respected. We appreciate you and love you so much, Gab. I'm so fortunate to be able to use the gift of storytelling to bring visibility to marginalized stories. Endlessly grateful for those who have given me opportunity, opened the doors, Terrell McCraney, Janet Mock, Dominic Mariso, Ryan Murphy, Elegance Bratton, who is here tonight, the writer and director of The Inspection. I love you. Um, thank you for allowing me to be a vessel for something that is bigger than myself, um, to represent and lead Black stories with nuance and emotional truth. Um, I wanted to take this moment to thank all of the black men who have been influential in my life, who didn't allow hypermasculinity or these ideas of who we are supposed to be for each other get in the way of loving and supporting me fully. Um, one of my heroes is here tonight, my dad. All right, um, my dad, Ty Pope, is here tonight. He is a professional bodybuilder and a pastor when I was growing up and didn't disown me when I told him I wanted to be a Destiny's Child. I'm so grateful for our relationship and your dedication to being the best father you could be for me. All right. It takes, it takes an open heart and an open mind to learn how to unconditionally love one another. As we continue to build and fight in community, we know that we are targeted. Our trans brothers and sisters, our rights seem to be at stake. And at times, I find my heart wrestling with this idea of how do I know that it's going to be OK? But it's rooms like this that remind me of the power of this community the power of love, how we will rise time and time again for each other. Yeah, let's give it up for ourselves, you know, like. But what I'm talking about is freedom, liberation, intentional love and support that runs longer than the Underground Railroad my ancestors ran upon. I refuse to use my time on this earth living in shame, and I ask you to do the same. No need, no need to make yourself small or, or limit what's tangible and possible for your life based on the lack of vision and self-respect other, others feel about themselves and in return try to project onto you. That ain't got nothing to do with you besides block your blessings. I want y'all to know we are unique. I want y'all to know that we are beautiful. We are chosen for greatness, all of us, chosen to use our time on this earth to plant seeds of prosperity and ideas of a better tomorrow for the next generation of warriors. This room, this room has so many beautiful and courageous people with so much love to give. May we continue to be the unthinkable and achieve the impossible. Thank you so much for this honor.